Hello, you amazing patrons. Uh, just Peter Laws checking in to say hello. Welcome to 2022. And to let you know that the Peter Laws podcast will be back tomorrow. So if you are a patron on the Morbid Member and Above tier, then you will receive that tomorrow morning at about 6 a.m. Uh, in that show, we're exploring some vengeful killer monkeys, the growth of rabies deaths in the USA, talking about witchcraft uh, hunts and um, apology, apologies in Scotland, but also specifically um, looking at this book, um, which is The Ruin of All Witches, which I just finished the other day, which is excellent, um, which is about a witchcraft case in Springfield, Massachusetts, which I've never heard about. I explore that in the podcast tomorrow. And um, yeah, there's uh, wrong car stories and all these sorts of things, and um, it's a fun show. Well, actually, it's quite dark in places, uh, especially the stuff about animals, but you'll be fine. Um, to let you know that uh, a new episode of Frightful just came out uh, about the dark side of Central Park. There's some quite w w weird stories in that, including like the, dark, the, the one that got under my skin the most, which was about a peeping Tom with a wolf's head mask on. That was weird. Um, anyway, that's out now, and there'll be a new episode of that next weekend. Um, as uh, you'll know, Creepy Coves takes a little break, uh, and um, so that should be back in May, probably March, March sort of time. I'll keep you informed of that. Um, now I'm going to show you something cool. Uh, well, it's cool, but it's a bit dark. And a bit, <laughs> it's a gift I got from my sister. Look at this. The Serial Killer Coloring Book. I, I've known about all these coloring books, of course, but um, seen like horror ones and stuff. I've never seen the serial killer one, so it's kind of it's a bit messed up, really. But um, but but quite impressive drawings. It's uh, but you know, I don't know, like look at like the Moors murderer and stuff, and it's like got a it's got like little kids' toys at the bottom, so you could say it's a bad taste. But um, Harold Shipman, all these sorts of things. I don't know if you've. Uh, Done many coloring books yourselves, but um, I started on one of them. Let me show you. Let me see. I, I made a start on the Yosemite Park Killer. I don't really know who he is, but um, I quite like the look of those mountains at the top. So I had to go. <laughs> it's my rudimentary coloring. But yeah, there you go. The um, lots of uh, Randy Craft. Who's that? I don't know him. Um, or Craigie Peter Sutcliffe, the Yorkshire Ripper. Um, but you know, there's a there's a market for these things and. Um, Colouring can be quite therapeutic and uh, who knows, may stop some people from committing the act of murder or driving them to it. Um, oh, I also got a cool candle. I don't know if you can see this candle here, but it's... Let's see if I can it down. See that? Oh dear, I better not do that. The heat's probably going to melt my phone. It's one of those crackling candles that, you know, make the sound of a fireplace. Anyway, enough about that. I'm going to wrap up because I have to go now and um, my column is due in this week so I have to now go and watch Jacob's Wife which I've never seen and Seance which I haven't seen but some of you lot have seen it and told me that they're very good so I'm looking forward to checking them out um, so I'll see you in the podcast tomorrow or uh, you know some at some point over um, the next week or so via the internet take care everyone bye bye